What up guys, Christian with Bulletproof Fitness. Got another shoulder and rear delt workout. Shoulders and traps actually. Uh, right here started off with 100, dumb 100 pound dumbbell shoulder press. Uh, this is actually the second time I've tried the 100 pound dumbbells. Before then I was on 95s and right here I'm doing the 100s. So I did three sets of 10. On my first two sets, I got all 10 reps. Third set, managed to only get nine. Rocking the uh, Superman tank top shirt. Looks pretty cool, I think. So yeah, uh, uh, my range of motion right here, I'm just going right at parallel. This works good for me. Might not work good for you, but it does for me. So I did three sets of ten. This is my third set right here, I believe. Wrapping it out. Now, on this bench, it's a little short, so I'm able to pin my shoulder blades on the back of it. So if it was just if it was a little higher, I probably wouldn't be doing the 100 pound dumbbells. But I'm able to, so. That's what I'm doing. So I failed on that 10th rep. And then after that, I went ahead and did a hammer shoulder press, three sets of 10. Right here, I'm working with 250 pounds. On the first two, I managed to get all 10 reps. On my third set, I only managed to get nine. I believe the last shoulder workout, you saw me working with 240 or 245, don't not remember. So yeah, I'm making a little progression, even still while I'm on a deficit in my calories. Right here, I'm grinding them out. This is what I was like I said. And then after that, I went ahead and did uh, cable side laterals. I used to do, I was before this, I was doing the uh, dumbbells and uh, with the cable you get a little bit more different feel you can't cheat as much when using the cables just keeping constant tension even when you're at the bottom you can see my striations coming in on my shoulders as I'm getting leaner look at the rear delts and the caps right there looking pretty lean so I did same thing uh, three sets of ten but I'm oh actually no three sets going for 13 to 15 reps and uh, on these I did managed to get all 15 15 reps on all three sets and uh, on my first two I did it the cable in front and then on the uh, on this third set right here change it up a little bit get a little bit different feel have the cable behind me it's basically the same thing it just feels a little different Struggling to get it up. I'm oh, looking at 20 pounds on this one. And uh, when doing side side laterals, you don't need a lot of weight. It feels a feel the muscle working. So then after after the side laterals. I jumped off with some face pulls as you see coming up. They're gonna be grinding out these last couple reps. Right here, face pulls. Good for the rear delts. When I'm at the back of the rep, I hold it for a quick second and squeeze. Another alternative you can do for face pulls is rear delt flies. I really don't like those in particular. Just uh, it feels weird on my shoulders, so I like to stick with the face pulls. And you can, if you see in the mirror, I am leaning a little back, just so I'm able to pull away the weight and it doesn't pull me forward. So on these, I did three sets, going for 13 to 15 reps, and managed to get all 15. And then after that, went ahead and did reverse shoulder press, which simulates behind the neck barbell press, and this is a little bit safer going for 8 to 10 reps 
Right here I'm working with 162.5 pounds. On my first set I got all 10 and second and third I only managed to get 9 reps. There's a different angle from the front. This was my third, second or third set. Grinding them out. And then went to standing shrugs on the machine. On these I like to lean forward. Going for 15 to 20 reps on sh shrugs and short range motions I like to go high reps. Three sets of ten and then after that finished off with some barbell shrugs. Three sets going for 15 to 20 reps. And this was my third set right here. I was working with 385 for all three sets. And uh, after this I did a drop set and did as many reps as I could. So yep, that was my shoulders and traps workout. So don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, see ya. He's going in for a bite. Good?